last hurrah. Got a lot of snow. My dry track went down today. Need to put one more in the freezer. We'll see what happens. All right, we found a we found a track that we think is uh last night's after we left. Not monstrous track by any means, but it's our last chance. We got to shoot something. We need one more, so uh, we're gonna take it for now. We'll see where it takes us. We know there's a bunch more deer where it's headed, so maybe it'll take us to something nice. Maybe not. Maybe we'll go look at it and shoot it. So we're heading in. Show you where we're heading. We're heading right up through here. The tracks right over here. Not much across the road last night. So only a couple. And this one's heading where we want to go, so we're gonna take this one. Let's go kill a deer. Should be a good time. Should be a good time. We've gotten into a pile of deer first hundred yards. I think they're heading the way we want to go, so they might be a little old, but we're going to take them for now, see what happens. Just giving you an update. So right now we're on, looks like three different deer. One of them looks like a buck, so hopefully we can stay on them. There's just so many deer in here, it's just hard to keep track of tracks. Everything looks the same in this fluffy snow. It's a pretty good track right there. Heading up through here. That's a pretty big bed. Not sure if we jumped him or not. Let's take a look. Got right through there. He's skipping down through. We might have jumped him. We got right in the barnyard of deer right off the bat. A lot of zigzagging around trying to sort things out. I think we got it sorted out, but it just seems like every deer in the woods is running. Like every deer. They've already even stepped in the woods. I think just when I got out of the car to look at the track, I disturbed the woods. So, deer were all right there, 150 yards off the road. So, anyways, we're going to get on this guy and try to stay on him. It's really tough. There's so many deer in here. But,. I believe this is fresh, so we're gonna stay on it as best we can. Try to get a look at this deer, get a shot at it. <sighs> Lord bless us. We found another barnyard here. Just quite a few deer in here. One big box in here. Looks like he's pissing all over himself. And it looks like maybe either he got in a fight with another buck or he was uh, laying a doe. Mountain one. It's a mess in here. Up over there it's a lot worse. It looked like it looked like you it looked like there was some struggling going on. So that's why I was assuming he probably was trying to get rid of a doe. I think we got his track, so we've been we've circled the whole barnyard here trying to find the best track leaving it and I think we got his. We're just gonna try to follow it and try to shoot him. So the winds have been kinda crappy. You know, every way we're heading the deer all seem to be downwind, which is kinda frustrating. But hopefully that changes when we get lucky, so Alright, let's go. Get on him.
slow down here just a minute. All right, guys, we caught them in these hemlocks, bedded. I took a Hail Mary, a Hail Mary shot. <clears throat> and uh, anyways, uh, I, I hit one, I, can, I got some blood. I didn't have my GoPro on, I was getting ready to turn it on, but. I was going to wait a little longer. I mean, I shot through hell. Through the thickest stuff I've ever shot a muzzleloader through. I didn't think there was any way I was going to bullet through. But I can see I got some blood up here, so I think I, I hit one. So we're going to go see if we can either find it or finish it off. GoPro is running. All right, let's go. I'm gonna get on it real quick and try to catch up and finish it off. All right, here goes. I'm gonna put my phone away. We got her. Probably about 150 yards and she's laying down over here. Looking back. We just ran up and put the finishing shot on her. Good deal. Take a look at her. She's out. Pretty spot here. Public land tracking. You gotta love it. If only it was a nice buck. But I'm thankful for this deer. It's two deer in the freezer. That is plenty for the year. And uh, anyways, a good thing. I'm not too far to drag, I don't think. I think I got less than a mile drag. So I don't think that'll be too bad. And the snow, it should pull really nice. Uh, 
good deal. You know, I took a Hail Mary shot. And I hit the snake and <laughs> I did not think there was a chance. I was like, they're going. There they go. Take a shot. You got a doe tag. You need another deer. And so I took the shot. And I get over there at first. Again, nothing, nothing. And I just see the blood. I was like, man. Pretty exciting. So time to get her cleaned up and get out of here. Finally killed a deer over here. We've seen quite a few nice bucks this year in here. Bow hunting, but couldn't make it happen. Just gonna get a shot. Maybe next year. Go public land hunting. All right, over and out. Well, that concludes 2020 in New York. Thank God 2020 is over. It's been a crappy year. A beautiful Toyota that people like to make fun of. Screw them. Beautiful animal. Anyways. So yeah, after we had found that nice buck track, we just got into another barnyard of deer. There was just so many deer. And we took the uh, the track that we thought was his, and we were probably only 100 yards from where we believe we lost this track. Because there's just so many tracks, and we took the biggest herd of deer that we're going together, which we probably shouldn't have done, because normally the big ones don't go with everybody else. But I was just following them a little ways, and I figured they're bedded there pretty soon. And I saw her jump up out, threw the scope up, one open window, took the shot. And then I saw the other ones take off running too, so. So we fill a doe tag. Next year, maybe we'll get that big buck we were hoping to get. It's kind of a rough year. Lots of sightings, but they kept catching us before we could get a shot off. Just didn't have the shot opportunity this year. Big bummer, but I guess it happens. Maybe next year.